Welcome to the tutorial on notes and basic commands. In this tutorial, we will learn to add child and sibling notes, edit node text, change color, font and formatting, change node style, move a note in the canvas and save the map. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux version 16.04 OS and Freeplane 1.7.10. To follow this tutorial, learner must be familiar with the Freeplane interface. For prerequisite tutorials, please visit this site. Link for class 9 in CERT. Science textbook on natural resources is given here. Press the Windows key on the keyboard. In the search form, type free plane. Double click on the free plane icon to open the program. The program may open with a previously loaded map. Press Ctrl and N keys together or click on File New Map. A select template dialog box opens. I will leave the remember my decision checkbox unchecked for now. Click on the drop down. Select standard hyphen 1.6.mm. Click on the OK button. A new map opens with the root node. The node has new mind map written in it for node text. It is the only node present in the map and is automatically selected. Double click on the root node to edit it. Type natural resources in it and press enter. This is called inline editing. For rich text formatting, right click on the node to open the context menu. Choose edit node core in dialog from the menu. Edit Node Core in dialog box opens. Notice the font, size, text color and alignment formatting options. Select and highlight the text in the form. In font size drop down, set font size to 18 and click on bold font. You may choose to change the font style if desired. Text can be aligned to left, right or center. Click on the OK button. It is seen on the lower end of the screen for me. Let's add the concepts about natural resources to the map. To add a child node, click on the edit menu. Select new node, then new child node. Type water as the node text and press enter. Alternately, press the insert key on the keyboard to insert the child node. Click on edit, new node, new sibling node to add a sibling node. Now we have a sibling node to water. Type air for the node text. Keyboard shortcut to add sibling nodes is to press enter. Now add three more sibling nodes to air node. I will assign them to soil, energy and wind which are natural resources. I will use the keyboard shortcut to add the siblings. Let's format the map using the tool panel. I will select the root node. To open the tool panel, click on the arrow seen on the right middle side of the window. In the tool panel, click on the format tab. Zoom and reposition the map to suit your convenience. In the color of whole core section, click on the rectangle next to background. The background dialog box appears with many tab choices. In the swatches tab, notice the color choices available. In the RGB panel, I will select the yellow color and click on the OK button in the box. 
It is seen on the lower end of the screen for me. The color change is visible only when another node gets selected. Scroll down the tool panel. Font for whole core section can also be used to format fonts. Scroll down the tool panel. Node shape, node border, edges and edge color can also be formatted here. Click on format on the top menu and select automatic layout. The automatic layout is disabled for me. I will change the layout to for all notes option. Now color, font and note styles change across the map. You can also set styles using the apply style option in the format menu. Depending on the operating system, the option may be called apply style levels. To choose an option in the menu, click and select the checkbox on it. One can choose from topic, subtopic or sub-subtopic option. The different levels arrange hierarchy of nodes into preset styles. Level 1 may be chosen for all child nodes from the root node. Level 2 may be chosen for grandchildren and so on. You may pause the video and familiarize with the options under Apply Style. Click on the right arrow in the tool panel to hide it. Now let's add concepts to the water node. Click and select the water node. Add 5 water related concepts as child nodes of water as seen on the screen. They are rain and snow, harvesting, sustenance, acid rain and water pollution. Notice the dynamic positioning of nodes in the canvas when children are added. This prevents the node texts from overlapping with each other. Next, add three child nodes for the air concept. Enter the three child concepts of air as seen on the screen. You may want to move the positions of the nodes at this point. To shift the water node upwards, first select it. Move the cursor slightly towards the connecting line till an ellipse is seen. The cursor also shows a hand sign. In some operating systems, the cursor may change to a four direction arrow. Click and drag the node upwards where you want it to be. I will place it a bit upward for clarity. Next, add coal and petroleum products as two concepts in energy. Type coal and petroleum products in the child notes. Both of these contribute to air pollution. Add a summary node for this concept. Hold down the shift key. Click on both child nodes under energy to select them. Go to edit menu, new node, new summary node and click on it. Type burning fossil fuels for node text. Similarly, child nodes of air represent three facets of air pollution. Add a summary node for these three child node concepts. Label it air pollution. Next, add a child node to wind and label it clean energy. Let's select it. Clean energy is different from fossil fuel energy. Let's type windmills as a child node to the clean energy node. Click on file, save map to save the map. I will save the file in the desktop directory. For file name, type naturalresources.mm and click on save. You may pause the video and explore more formatting options. 
Click on File, Quit Free Plane to quit Free Plane. Now let's summarize. In this tutorial, we added child notes, added sibling and grandchild notes, changed font, color and formatting, changed note style, moved a node in the canvas and saved the map. For assignment, please do the following. Add more concepts to the map as seen in the image here. You may also add your own ideas. Color according to properties or branch. And explore more formatting options. This video summarizes the Spoken Tutorial project. Please download and watch it. Spoken Tutorial team conducts workshops and gives certificates. For more details, please write to us. Please post your timed queries in the forum. Spoken Tutorial project is funded by MHRD, Government of India. This is Rani from IIT Bombay. Thank you for joining.